Last weekend, Montpellier finally claimed their first home win in Ligue 1 Comparama since the start of February after getting the better of Nice. On Sunday, they were looking to make it two on the bounce against their local rivals Nîmes in the first long dock derby to be played in the top flight for 25 years. Le Croco looking to end a run of five games without a win. Their last three outings have been draws against Bordeaux, Monaco and Gangon. Michel Desacarim would have been happy to see his Montpellier side make a positive start. Florent Molle coming down the right-hand side here. Dangerous ball in that was well intercepted by goalkeeper Paul Bernardoni. Amboise Oyongo with the follow-up, headed away. But it was Oyongo who went on to give the host the lead on 29 minutes. Mustafa Diallo heading the ball back into a dangerous area. And there was the Cameroonian nipping in to poke home his second goal of the season. Well, there was a brief delay in proceedings. And the supporters celebrated that goal. A barrier collapsing in the stands. But once they got back underway, Nim coming on the hunt for an equaliser. Feitu Moassa forcing a good stop there from Benjamin Leconce. And the follow-up blocked. And Montpellier were then awarded a penalty deep in first half stoppage time. The corner in from Molle. And after conferring with the VAR, the referee pointed to the spot. The Nîmes captain, Anthony Briançon, just on the edge of the six-yard box there, pulling down Pedro Mendes. So the referee awarding the spot kick. Andy Delors doing the honours. Stroking that one home for his second goal in as many matches in Ligue 1 Conferama. Montpellier 2-0 up and cruising after an excellent first half performance. Well, into the second half, and still it was De Zakarian's men dominating. Molle picking the ball up here. Nice little ball through for Delors. A ferocious effort. Goalkeeper Bernardoni was beaten. But Delors denied by the crossbar. And Molle then found the woodwork himself with that sensational free kick. Juninho, eat your heart out. Very close to one of the goals of the season. Well, the third goal did eventually arrive 12 minutes from time, with Molle and Ayongo involved in the build-up. Molle crossing for Gaetan Laborde to head in his second goal since his summer move from Bordeaux. Lovely there from a young go to set Molly away. And the board applying the finish. Montpellier taking the local bragging rights after an impressive showing. Claiming back-to-back -back home wins for just the second time in 2018. And they were temporarily up to second place before Marseille's trip to Lille on Sunday night. <laughs>